I so look! Once a cheater, so always a cheater. Listening into everything. We still have a couple more cameras to set up, but these are the ones we got so far. Oh yeah. Today we're placing Nia's boyfriend DeAndre to a loyalty test. Oh yeah, he's cheating. Is that Malibu? Our decoy Violet will be testing DeAndre's loyalty by asking him on a date. Will he remain loyal or fumble a good woman? Nervous? Yeah, my heart feels like he's gonna pass, but my mind feels different. Mmm, when the heart and mind echo! Man, how the f is that possible? Hello? Hey, is this DeAndre for the Becky reservation? Oh, yes, this is him. Okay, okay. this is Nathan. Um, I'm the one that owns the house. Are we still good for five today? Yeah, this is good. I'll okay. Head it over soon. Oh, okay, no, that's perfect, perfect. All right, well, if anything happens or anything comes up, just let me know, but I'll be here. I'll be waiting for you. We'll do. See you soon. Alright, I'll see you right now. Yes, sir. Uh, we're still on. Let's go. <laughs> Why are you nervous? I'm nervous. I, I'm optimistic. I don't think you should be too nervous about this. I think it'll be alright. I wanted to place her boyfriend to the test because she's actually caught him cheating before. Yeah, he cheated on her before. Damn. She didn't want to go into too much detail about it, but she told us that they had a thing, but nothing intimate ever happened between them. I did. What the fuck is the point of this loyalty test? You know he's not loyal! did ask if she could clarify what a thing meant, but she didn't want to talk about it. And I get it. To this day, Nia questions if taking DeAndre back was a smart move, so talking about it might make her double think even doing this test. Oh, trust me, I was nosy. I wanted to know. But number one, we gotta respect what she wants. And number two, this house was expensive. You'd be surprised how many day before or day of cancellations we've had. So, yeah, we weren't about to risk losing that cash. He's already cheated? He's cheated before. What so... made you decide to take him back? I ask myself that every day, honestly. Damn, that one that's such a like sad. Like, oh my God, that's the saddest answer. I ask myself that every day, and that's why she's here. It makes sense. That's because you just want to like see like. I want to see it. If he's worth taking yeah. back, type thing. Yeah, like if he's wasting my time. Sure. Yeah, yeah, he doesn't know. I I talk to the girl. Uh huh. And. Uh? You talk to the girl. I call her. I talk to her. Oh, so that's how you confirmed it, basically. Yeah. Yeah. Cheating is cheating no matter what degree. And since the incident, DeAndre's saying that he's changed and that he's different. Nia wants to put that to the test. Obviously, we have history. So I have like a weak spot for him, but. Is he like working towards fixing everything though? He's he's yeah, he's making a consistent effort. Has he ever lied to you like about anything since then? You, or you feel no, like he's talking about girls? No, not that I know of. No. Mm -mm. Do you believe in the saying, once a cheater, always a cheater? I don't want to believe it. <laughs> <laughs> She's in so love, chat. Like going into Get this ass. test, do you feel like he's gonna cheat or you think he's gonna pass? My heart feels like he's gonna pass, but my mind feels different. So then today, like, what would be like a fail for you? Like, if he like got He gets her number, it's, it's over. Okay, what if he's just being oh, like- Oh, he's definitely friendly? failing. Come on, man, he's definitely failing that. That's what I'm saying, like, it's because of the past. It's, it's, it's really like tough. I feel like I can't give him any grace. Like, there's no benefit of the doubt. I mean, he put you through some shit. So. Exactly. Number, Instagram, any it's hard. contact, it's over. Yeah. I don't know. I couldn't, but, you know, shows Wait, what's wrong with IG, though? Chance, so yeah. hopefully he doesn't it up. Ah, I I'm chatting. I just sure, like, I don't push any boundaries I know or why. anything. So, um, is there anything specific you don't want me to do? Um, honestly, I want you to just do you, and I want to see him. Okay. If I'm being real, this test is an uphill battle. It might be unpopular to say, but I do believe some people deserve a second chance. However, that doesn't mean that you're blindly just gonna trust them again. If it were me personally, like he'd be cut off. I would not put up with that. It's like if you break a mug, I'm like you can kind yeah, of. Yeah, that shit's together, easy to say. Okay, until so you fall in love with somebody and they really cheat on you. Wants him to fail so that she can like move on. Get because I just like feel like she already deserves better than what she's putting up with right now. And she seems like she's like down for him. Like she seems like a ride or die. Like I get that vibe from her. She probably just still has that attachment and like needs to really see it is what I think. I hope he passes because it just, it just shows that people can change over time. I don't know. I'm not I, saying he won't pass. Yeah. I'm just saying if it was me, there wouldn't be that second exactly. chance. Exactly. You could do a lot of things, but if you cheat, that's that's what Exactly. Sort of, we'll have Nathan give him a call in a little bit <laughs> to make sure that he's still gonna be coming later today. Hey, they, hey, them boys chatting right now, yo, Fab. Thank you for the gift, bro. Him? Do you want to catch him? I want to not waste my time. I would want for him to love me and, and not pass, embarrass so. me. Cheating on her is diabolical. Bro, that's some incel shit to say, my nigga. I don't give a fuck how bad you look. You can get cheated on. <laughs> What you, you think you could look good enough to the point where no one's gonna wanna cheat on you? Nigga, shut up, bro. But honestly, I'm just, 
I'm like 50 50. So it's like, how do you think you'd react if he fails? I'm gonna be pissed. You'd be pissed. I'm gonna be pissed, but I don't think I'm fully prepared. Like, I don't know how I'm gonna react. I don't. Would you want to go down and confront him and all that? Yo, fat. Thank you for the gift, broski. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, a whole nother side is gonna come out. Wow. Yeah. Now, that's what a fact. Someone in chat said actually is the opposite. No, ugly niggas be more loyal, bro. <laughs> Dead ass. No cap, man. No cap. I feel like the more attractive you are, the higher the likelihood is you're going to cheat on somebody, bro. Oh, God. It's just like, it's a volume thing. Eventually, you're going to find somebody that, you know what I'm saying? This is the test. Then we're together, ready to have a baby. <laughs> Why you say Beyonce? What the fuck she do? Confirming DeAndre would still be coming over later uh. today, we confirmed that everyone involved in her plan understood their roles. I honestly hope DeAndre pulls through and passes. He's got a lot of making up to do, so hopefully he can turn down our decoy and start showing Nyan that he truly is a genius. Someone said Lowe's ugly and hate. <laughs> Y'all niggas so annoying. You know, the good oh thing my is, god. We're three stories up, but then also the waves. Yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> so yeah. loud. Even if we're loud, I don't think they'll be able to hear us. With everything and everyone set up and ready to go, all we had to do was wait for DeAndre to arrive. Nervous? Yeah. Hello? Oh, alright, I think he's here. Yeah, this is him. Okay, perfect. Yo, they uh, did a lot of like unnecessary the backstory this video. The, like the left or the right side, just really This is really the start right here. Mm -hmm. Okay, perfect. I'll meet you up right now then. Bye, like Kyle. DeAndre has arrived. DeAndre has arrived. Oh gosh. I'm much more nervous about this parking job than I am about the day. Uh, oh, there nah. he is. <clears throat> this is ironic. This what is the fuck? Oh, please don't park too close. That's all I'm thinking right now. You, you know, I didn't even like pass my driver's test. But how do you have your license? The guy who was testing me, he was like, you drove on the wrong side of the road, you didn't stop at this sign, you did this, that, whatever. And then the third time, I think he just felt bad. He was trying to fuck! Oh, nah, hey, I, and now I know why somebody macked my fucking TRX, bro. I know why my shit got rear-ended. Because there's too many horny driving test instructors trying to fuck! Putting fucking bad drivers on the road, man! And that's... So I'm glad you can make it. Uh, yeah, was there any like uh I didn't even realize that's a potential place? issue we're dealing with. Yo, we gotta we gotta plug that hole, chat. That can't happen. But she drove on the wrong side of the road and passed. If you drive on the wrong side of the road, you should be suspended for a year. Minimum. Oh yeah, you're gonna like this place. I'm telling yeah, you, nice, this is like when I'm in town. This is usually where I party at. I mean, dude, we got balconies right here. We have another one under there. We got like rooms up top. We have some under, so it's gonna be a really cool spot. Nigga right? said yeah, cops yeah. trying to uh, fuck if you. Want, too. You can sit down on the couch. I've got a few rules, dude. Nothing crazy. I'm pretty chill here for the most part. I, mean, I party here myself. Yeah. I'm saying like you, a young dude. I'm a young dude. I turn up, bro. So I know how it gets. I know how it gets. Hey, Violet, you're gonna make your entrance. Okay, okay. okay. Dude, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Pump it up. Jesus, why are they so pumped up? Oh my god. The main thing for me, bro, is just don't smoke inside. You can play music, you know, have fun, everything around 11. Just turn it down. You don't got to turn it off, but you know what I mean? Still have your fun. To get DeAndre here, Nyan told him that her supposed friend's Becky rented Nathan's Malibu Airbnb for a wild party. And then another thing, too, is just no pets in here. You know, I don't want any fur or anything. Get on the couch. It's a brand new. Nyan told DeAndre that Nathan wouldn't be handing over the keys without going over some house. Slam, thank Becky. you, Louisa. Unfortunately, Ask, though, welcome Becky back. couldn't make it to this orientation. Queen, welcome back. So she asked Nyan to yeah. As it turns up, out, Naya couldn't make it either, but she asked DeAndre to go in her place, knowing he would be available when I was up for being outside. Yeah, mainly, man, just have fun, turn up a little bit, have one room upstairs, kind of off limits, you guys. Okay, there's there's just no way. You're gonna need to back up and then go in. Okay, hold on. This is scary. As you all know, though, there was no Becky and there was gonna be no party. We just made up this entire story to get DeAndre to come over. Yeah. Violet, you're doing fantastic. I think, honestly, I'm starting to feel a little more confident. Okay. Yeah, all right, for now. Violet manages to park one eternity later, and Kyle slips his way into the garage. Yeah. One and two were like, oh, someone's here. I'll be right back. Maybe said that's LSK. Violet. <laughs> here comes Violet. <laughs> Hi. Hey. Bro. I'm here for Becky. LSK 610, oh, buddy. Someone's actually here already, checking in. Oh. Is Becky here? No, it's actually not Becky. It's a guy. Uh, uh -oh. I know him, I guess. He's with you guys, um. so. Hey, are you here for Becky? She sent you too? Um, she literally told me to come here like last night. One second. Yeah, I just got Let me see. Call today. Hi, so. Uh, 
Okay. Honestly, it's probably better anyways. I have both of you guys here, so. Let me check my recipe. The imaginary Becky supposedly asked Violet to also come pick up the keys, but since Naya told her that DeAndre was coming in her place, Becky told Violet not to come anymore. Oh, she did tell me. I must have just not seen the message. Don't pay attention, huh? No, it's all good. Honestly, it's probably a little bit better anyways. Like, I was just showing them kind of like, the balcony right here. I was gonna give them a tour of the rest of the house too, run down some of the rules, so probably better I got both of you guys here anyways, you know, okay. just in case I have two people to listen to it. And that way you don't get blamed if something goes wrong, so we just throw it on her. I know you turn up, though. I can see, I can know you like to turn up, though, but at least there's two of you guys listening, so. Nathan's doing good. Nathan's coming yeah, he up is, like he is, he's doing good. But yeah, like I said, I was telling him to smoke outside. Even the balcony down here that I'm about to show you, you can even smoke down there. Nathan's Five. character was meant to break Five, the ice between nigga. Violet and DeAndre and set the tone for the rest of the test. So like I said, this is like a little bigger balcony for me, you know what I'm saying? You guys can kind of chill here. There's enough room for everything. If you guys have too many people, someone gets too drunk, I don't want you guys obviously to drink and drive. You guys have an extra yeah. little room over here as well. So I still have three other rooms up there, though, so you guys got plenty of rooms, you know what I'm saying? If you guys turn up, you got plenty of places to crash. Wi-Fi is on the fridge, I think. Or it might be on the counter for you. I know you probably want to take a little Instagram photo. Do a little Instagram <laughs> model, you feel me? And then right... Yo, why Twitter just text me? And he said, I'm about to throw this up on a story. Whoever, whoever designed my forehead... I'm going to make sure you get fired, buddy. I, my shit is not that big, gang. These artists is using their artistic creativity to extend my shit. And stop. Damn. Right here. Yeah, Whoa. straight to, yeah. I mean, you could literally just walk down there if you wow. guys wanted to, so. I have a business meeting right now coming up, so I'm gonna get out of here. Okay. Other than that, yeah, like I told you guys too, those couches are brand new, so please, please. It's bigger please, in person. Nick like can never even shots, met Do it over there on the counter. Yo. Does <laughs> I have the keys to get you guys? Probably give it to, oh, no, you look like, bro, you look, I don't know, man. You gonna turn up, I want you to turn up. I don't want you to have the responsibility of the keys, bro. You're right, you're right, you're right. I got it. You got it? Okay. And there's a bottle opener on there too for you guys, so, you know, just enough to make with. Okay. All right, guys, Thank well, have you. fun. Don't have too much fun. Well, you have my number two. Yes. Do you have my number? Uh, yeah, I got you. So if anything goes wrong, just call me. Double so cheeked up! In town, so. Sorry. And he's literally just looking. there for the key. So hopefully he quickly says, I got to take off. He's Zeus, take me to tier one. <laughs> Yo, Amanda, welcome back. Smokey, welcome, welcome back. Free, welcome back. And keep so there, welcome back, bro. Hopefully he. Yep, you should be leaving. Yeah, honestly, I thought I was gonna be the only one here. <laughs> yeah, she told me to come by to get the keys last I night, saw. but I guess she must have told me not to come anymore, like I saw, and I just didn't see it. But honestly, it's for the best. I didn't really want to go to to work today, anyways. So. You caught on. Yeah. Yo, my nigga, yo, my nigga, Phantom. Yo, my nigga, Phantom. What's up, bro? Thank you for the five gifted subs, Phantom. And I really appreciate that. I want you to know we all love you here at the agency, Phantom. Yo, Phantom 903. Yo, you're my brother for life, man. Appreciate you, broski. Uh, Cut the small talk. Nathan broke the ice perfectly between Violet and DeAndre, setting up the rest of this test beautifully. As instructed, he sneakily joins Kyle in the garage. He seems chill, bro. Nigga like, said honestly, W like, voice today, review. Like, I feel like he felt chill, cool, <laughs> but I can see how he can get girls, you know what I'm saying? Honestly, on my way here, I was Perfect. texting. Well, song. not texting. I was on the phone with my boyfriend. My ex-boyfriend. And he was just like, I don't know. He's being like a dick right now. Yeah. So I think this is going to be good to like take my mind off things. Okay. What you mean? Hey, what you mean? What happened, nigga? It's none of your business, bitch. Damn, bro, niggas always so nosy trying to be in the drama and shit. Yo, I'm telling you, bro, reality TV has fucked us up, man. DeAndre walked right into our plan. I mean, either way, Violet was gonna bring this. Yo, my mom blamed me yesterday. I was on the phone with her, and she's like, she's like, my damn, my little brother's always on the phone. I'm like, take the phone. He used to take our controllers, and she's like, nah, I can't because now he's like, he's about to be 17. You can't take. And I thought, like, Mom, you used to take our shit all the time. And then she said, it's your fault. Huh? She's like, he be watching you and all the other people. I'm like, you gonna blame me? Man, take that now. Take that nigga phone, bruh. This up, but it coming from him shows how comfortable he's gotten with her. Violet explains that the reason that she didn't see Becky's text to not come get the keys anymore was because she was arguing with her ex-boyfriend. He's supposedly trying to take I mean, ga I, be I was, I was gaslit. And he literally doesn't even take care of it, so I don't know why he all of a sudden wants it so bad. Like, what is he, a counselor? What would you want him to say right now? I would want him to say, look, hope everything works out with Nigga that. Nigga said no more V-Bucks. I gotta get going. <laughs> yeah, 
can try to have a good weekend, not deal with all that drama. I don't know why I'm already throwing that onto you. What was your name, by the way? Sorry. I'm DeAndre. My name is Violet. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. <laughs> like, he's Yo. so funny. Giggly Yo. ass. Look at him just cheesing. How long were you planning on being here, by the way? Because I just have some stuff in my car. I was wondering if maybe you could help me grab it. I'll be here for a minute, sure. Okay, thank you so much. I appreciate it. It's just like my bag, some drinks, and because like party. <laughs> mm -mm. DeAndre wasn't leaving, but it's only partially his fault. I mean, our test was designed to keep him there. It was moving fast. Our plan was meticulous, and everything would connect soon enough. Violet now had to start wanting to take photos. To give him the benefit of the doubt, maybe he liked the house so much that he's yeah. down to like chill, like, check it out a I'll be here bit. a minute. What? But yeah, I'm super excited. I'm gonna have to take like a bunch of pictures. Like, that's insane. Um, I don't want to hate your car, so. Okay, all right, sounds good. Is there confidence in him going down? But it was hella space. What is she like talking about? Not technically not doing anything wrong, but I don't like it. Oh. <laughs> yeah, thank you. True. Thank you. Azuz, really yo, hold on, chat. Get your fingers ready and put some W's in the chat. Azuz, just get the 25, bro. I appreciate that. I really genuinely, yo, 25 out of nowhere. Yo, the sub count on the top left is, is frozen, too. I don't know why. I'm going to be honest with you. But Azuz, I appreciate that. And to the 25 that just received the gift, please make sure to say thank you to Azuz. Yo, thank you so much, my nigga. I appreciate the love, for real. W Azuz! W Azuz, man. W Azuz. W Azuz. It's a good fucking guy, man. I really appreciate that. Oh, thank you. I appreciate it. Thanks, Broski. <laughs> no, I'm super excited though. Like, it's we're at 16k. So here. I've never ever been to like a house like this before. Crazy. Yeah, no, this is my first time coming to something like this. It's too. so pretty. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna maybe take some pictures. The plan is for Violet to lure DeAndre outside to the beach. That is where she'll eventually be making her move. I feel like right there should be fine. Thank you. Might as well take yeah. the top off. Thank she got it. She got some shit underneath. You. I'm just gonna take some pictures. You know what I'm saying? It's they so ain't Malibu. Pretty. Nice little Actually, beach vibes, shit like that. I don't, you don't need again, a hoodie I don't on. know how long you're planning to stay here, but could you do me like a huge favor? I really want to take some pictures here. Do you think you could help me take some? I really thought down there would be like good to like kind of like show off, look nice. Down. If you're down to like go to the sand with me, maybe we can take some down oh, there. Oh, you want to take photos in the sand? Yeah, if that's okay. Just like, I don't know, you don't have to. I totally get it. Say no, she's giving you a cop out. I don't know, it's so beautiful. Like, uh -huh. I, just, I have to, okay, I want to do it before like everyone gets here and I don't want to, you know. I got you. Yeah? <laughs> okay. I'm not gonna lie, I'm not taking no photos for nobody, nigga. I'm not your fucking photographer, okay? I am a great low key chat. Y'all don't know this. I'm a great photographer, okay? No cap. I'm really good. All right? I'm nice behind the fucking wheel. But I'm not taking flicks of you, okay? Every place we go, you want to take a flick? No, I don't want to take a flick, all right? I don't want to take a flick. <clears throat> if it's your mom, maybe. No, I tell her no, too. Bro, if it was up to my mom, man, we'd be taking family photos like 20 times a day, bro. You got to tell mom no sometimes, man. I'm going to grab my stuff really quick. It's so pretty. I'm super, super excited. Yo, no, Chris, thank you for the five get this sauce, Chris. <laughs> they say you're welcome. Hey, Book, thank you for the five as well. W gift, Chris, W gift, Book the Crook. Thank you, man. I appreciate that. W gifts, man. <clears throat> bro, horny. I'm not horny. I'm not horny. Yo, Book, thank you, bro. Chris, appreciate you. Then, Thanks, I Chris. I get the drinks, too, just because, like, He's being too friendly. What do you think of that? He's being way too friendly. Yeah. Like, way too friendly. Put bring... on space with the five now, yo. Space coming in with five this time. Damn, space. Thank you, broski. Thank you, man. Appreciate the fucking five. Put some stuff in my pictures. Make it look like I'm No, a... hold on. Ellie's coming in with the five. Wait. Yo, Ellie, message me. Hit me up, nigga. Uh, I'll get back to you after stream today or, or before stream tomorrow. Appreciate the five. Get Bye. the subs, nigga. Give an excuse. This is, it's just a favor. He's just trying to be nice. No. I mean, he is doing a favor, but he doesn't have to. He had a choice. Mm. Yeah, true. Mm. You know, so why? Hold on. Wait, damn. Why y'all niggas shooting in burst today? Shadows with the five. Shadows with the five. Get the subs. Hey, Shadows. Hey, man, I appreciate you a lot, Gangatron. W5 Gifty. This girl is insecure. No, this nigga cheated on her before. So, rightfully so, she can't trust the nigga no more. And so, why the fuck would she get a nigga the benefit of the doubt? 
Hey, Scuba, thank you for the five gift, Scuba. <laughs> Nothing to see here, man. Don't put me in no controversy, my nigga. W gifties, W gifties. Yo, if someone cheated on you, chat, you're not gonna, you're not gonna give them the benefit of the doubt. If they're in a situation that they shouldn't even be in in the fucking first place, right? Bro, loyalty can't be that hard, bro. Free Hawkins, thank you for the five. Damn, today, what's up? Yo, Free, thank you for the five. Weedy with the fucking five. Damn, bro. Damn, Weedy, appreciate you too, man. Free Hawkins, thank you. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> Wait, though. Wait, wait, wait. First of all, Carter, thank you for the 10. Get the subs. W gifts in a fucking chat. Carter, thank you for the 10. W10, W10, W10. And Azuz with another 25 gifted subs, bro. Azuz, what's up with you today, Boski? Nah, niggas is wildin' today. Hold on, because Slim came in with five gifted himself. And then Saw came in with five gifted himself. Thank you, Slim. Thank you, Saw. And then Guapo came in with five of his own, nigga. Hey, thank y'all, niggas, man. No cap. Guapo, appreciate it. Appreciate it. Bombastic, thank you for the fucking five gifted subs, bro. Yo, what's up? Why now, though? Why now? Hold it to the roll call. Hold it to the roll call. Hold it to the roll call. Yo, Bombastic, thank you for the fucking five. Get the subs. I appreciate it. I think even the drinks already, her taking the drinks down should be a red flag to him, too. Yo, Nas, thank you for the fucking five. Get the subs, nigga. W gifts in the chat. I don't know why I keep alternating between Nas and Weedy. I might just call you Nas, bro. Appreciate the five, man. It looks so gorgeous out here. It's nah, come on, chat. At this point. Yo, these niggas is going crazy, boom Bastic. Thank you for the five gifted, bro. W5 gifted, my nigga. W5 gifts, broski. Hey, I appreciate it, man. Merci beaucoup. You feel me? Thank you, thank you, thank you, bro. Super, super pretty. Can you help me carry this? Yeah, thank I you. All right, Kyle, Nathan, they're going to the beach. You guys are going to come upstairs. Over. Oh, the pictures are gonna look so good. Oh my god. Yo, she gonna have to cut this up. No, I gotta show off this weekend. Especially with what my ex is trying to do. I'm gonna post up looking good and stuff. Revenge plot? <laughs> Maybe, I don't know. We'll see. Oh, oh, thank you. <laughs> You're so sweet. You. Thank you. I'm She's my so giddy. Off. DeAndre basically saw through our plan. You'll see what I mean soon, but will this mean that he'll remain loyal? Here, I'm gonna set. Space. Space, thank you for the five gift of subs, broski. W Space in the chat. <laughs> niggas is crazy. Yo, they're actually insane, man. Space, thank it's you, bro. Awesome. We can start thank you, something. my guy. I'm not gonna lie here. He seems like a polite, friendly, and just an overall good person here, but maybe that's just the front. Or then again, maybe it's not. Maybe cheating in the past truly was just oh, a one off mistake. He's taking that's not really who he truly is. Good, not really a photographer. Yeah, let me see. At the same time, though, I can see DeAndre being too overly friendly and using his charm to just get what he wants. Hopefully, just hopefully, he can pass this test and start regaining Naya's trust. I mean, okay, look, this is how I think about it, chat. If he says no, he's kind of being an asshole. She's just asking you to take some photos. You know what I'm saying? Nothing crazy. Yo, you don't have to look too deep into it. Now, if he says anything at some point while he's taking the flicks to kind of, you know, apply some pressure, then then I think he's wrong. Then I think he's wrong. Violet has convinced DeAndre. So far, you could argue he's just being a good fucking guy. Possibly make her ex-boyfriend jealous. Maybe a little he's too so friendly, friendly, bro. How do you think he's gonna do now? My confidence is low. Your confidence is low. That's lower. a body. Really? <laughs> yes. So like that. that way we can see the beach, you know? Yeah. I saw Probably. DeAndre might be being a little too friendly. However, it's not necessarily a bad thing that he's helping Violet take some photos. He might just be in a good mood. Remember, Nathan did break the ice between them, making them super comfortable with each other. And the overall excitement of there being a party here later tonight probably has him in high spirits. This is crazy. Yeah. He's like a personal Yo, hey, thank you for the eight months. Yeah, wait, can you turn around? I'm gonna change really quick. Cause I wanna like make it look like I'm on the beach. Don't look, don't look. No. All right, now this is the point where I think Nigga need to say something. Like, oh, shit, I'm not comfortable with that. I'm in a relationship. Feel me? Because she can't come on, bro. Violet makes DeAndre turn around to get more comfortable, but also so that he doesn't see her mic pack as she does. Nigga, I know uh, it's you, Davis. Sorry. 
just adjusting myself. Oh no, y'all definitely teasing over here. Y'all definitely teasing this man. We're teasing. All right. Um, decent now. Yeah. Yeah, you're good. Here, can you take some? I just want to like, you know, show you everything better not off. Compliment okay, her. can you get some like higher angle? Yeah. And so with that, the Make Max boyfriend jealous photo shoot begins. Wait, I good flex. Like, sitting good down flex. Too, maybe like this. Oh wait, I want my drink too. It looks like I'm like having fun. This is crazy. Like this is crazy. Decent. Bro, even if he didn't. That's some southern shit. It means like I'm good. Like I'm clothed. You can come in. Like if you pop out the shower and say I'm decent, that means like someone could walk in the room. Before like how friendly he is. Like this is still kind of. Damn, he is going all out, huh? Look at him. <laughs> it's a full like, on shoot. Andrew, do you get good shots from there? Because it's also the balcony. Honestly, he's being overly friendly on yeah, this. Like, he's over here, like, going out of his way to hit all the angles for and stuff. But... Violet eventually suggests that DeAndre take photos of her a little further down the beach, which damn. wasn't part of our plan, but, I mean, whatever made this thing more realistic. Oh, damn, they're getting into it, into it. Look at that, they're walking away. They're out of our frame. You got them there, Andrew? Uh, he, I think he's... Okay. Maybe he's some about, he's about like to cross the line any yeah, second now. Yo, Maybe. Sean, thank you for the five gifted subs. W gifts in the chat. Let me grab a bed real quick. Sean, appreciate you a lot, bro. Thank you for the five, my nigga. <clears throat> Supreme Sean, W5. Like, oh, wait, See, I'm not getting my feet wet to take a flick of someone I don't know. See. Violet was doing a great job. These look so good. Thank you. I think I did good. So far, Violet had hit every single point in our plan. She now only had one more to go. I kind of have an idea. Um, Don't, like, I don't know. Give me, your, give me see your hand. Boom, he lost. To me, at this point, he failed. Yeah, let me see. At this point, he's done. Hold on. <laughs> wait. Okay, wait, wait. You can say no, but I have like a really, like look at how cute that, I have a really funny idea. What? You know how I'm like kind of mad at my ex right now? What if we just took some pictures, like I won't show your face or anything. Like it'd just be like, I see our hands like on the beach. And then I put them like on my story or something and make it look like I'm like soft launching us. We take some pictures where maybe it looks like we're a couple, just to like make him jealous, make it look like we're together. Just like if he sees my story and he sees me with a guy, I don't know. I'm sorry, oh, I'm being crazy. Man. I'm just mad about the dog, and I don't know. I feel like it. Let's do it. Yeah, you're down. Oh, oh you're God! For real? DeAndre agrees to help Violet further make her supposed ex-boyfriend jealous by taking some cute couples photos with her. Let me like look up some ideas really quick. Mm -hmm. I feel like. We could do Even this one. if he wasn't in a relationship, why would you do that with a stranger? <laughs> Yo, well, we know why, but I'm just, I'm being facetious. Okay, okay hold on. I'm the heart. Here. Yeah, wait, that's so cute. And with that, our entire oh, plan is yo, 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 Chris! Yo, Davis, remember when, no, not you, the other Chris, sorry. Remember when Chris did this? Remember when Chris did this right here on his IG story? Remember when he did cool. And uh, a part of me honestly feels like this plan was too well constructed. Seriously, go back and rewatch how everything connects and everything has a purpose to get us to this moment. That's so cute. I'm not gonna lie, she's cooking okay, though. Let's do one with our feet. I'm on it. I guess you could say it's not entirely his fault that he's here doing this, but at the same time, at any moment, he could have said no. This is embarrassing. I mean, there's a certain yeah. mistake that you have to yeah, do in the past. You can't afford to make these type of mistakes. He should have been in and out, got the keys, left. What are you doing? Okay, wait, let's take it like sitting down. At the end of the day though, DeAndre technically hasn't cheated yet. So yes, you could make the argument that the only reason he's taking these couple's photos with Violet is because of our plan. We'll give him that one. Next to mine, so we're like matching. There we go. Dusty Maybe feet. we could do one with Ugh. the drink so it looks like we're like, you know. Damn, he took a drink. Oh no. Nah. Nah, he oh, drinks nah. that. Our plan will allow Violet to make her move on him, but the choice to stay loyal will be DeAndre's. She isn't going to force him to do anything. So if he agrees to go on a date with her, that's all on him. Oh my gosh, wait. He's like so good. Oh my gosh. It's going to make him so mad. <laughs> I want to feel comfortable with this. Oh, he looks so cute. I think so. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> I, I kind of love them. <laughs> yeah, that's fire. They're fire. Honestly, like... Not so, you know, but I just, I just think that like. Oh no. Nah. Oh, they too no, close. Too oh close. no. This whore. It's a wrap for he's sure. a fucking it's whore. Mm. It's been a wrap. Yeah, he looks like he's trying. To he looks single. This is what this looks like. I don't know. Like I had all that happen with him, and then I. Yo, you know what's fire, chat? If she doesn't even say shit to this nigga, 
she just never speaks to him again, and then he sees his video drop like three weeks later. <laughs> I came here today, and like Becky didn't show up and everything, and now we're here together. And I don't know. I think like, yeah, like I don't know. I kind of feel like it's like, almost like they, right? Yeah. <laughs> I think we look really good together. I don't know. Like, we're hanging out here this weekend. I don't know, maybe. I mean, like you said, it might be like fate. Yeah. I mean, tonight, like, hang out, down. GGs. Yeah, GGs. I'd be down. GGs. We could use tonight GGs. to maybe GGs. get to know one another, like, see where things go. I'm down. Yeah, like, you know, I just got out of a relationship, so nothing too serious. If it, like, leads to that, sure, but, like, you know, just, like, get to know each other, see where it goes. Yeah. yeah. I'm with that. Yeah, you're with that? I am. Do you, if you're single, you don't have a girlfriend or anything? Nah. Nah? No girlfriend. Okay. How do you want to get it? Damn. So far, yo, yo. Yo, that's how my mom used to look at me when I was in trouble. <laughs> hey, the ass whooping of death follows these these eyes right here, man. Yeah, you're chilling. You don't have to listen. Maybe you have like a flame or something. Nah. No? That's all. Yeah. You're in my fun stage. You're in your fun stage? My hot boy. Oh, you're in your hot boy, yeah. Okay, I see you, hot boy. <laughs> cool. Well, yeah, maybe we can just like hang out tonight, see where it goes, mm -hmm. see what happens. Yeah, I'm open to that. Yeah. And just like that, DeAndre has failed this test. Okay, well, I'm down to hang out here for a little bit longer before the night. Yeah, for before, sure. Before, you know, the night starts and everything. You can hear from me. Okay. I'll get your number real quick. Okay. Right. And he had to finish it off with the number, damn. He asked for a number? Yeah. Maybe. He asked for her number. Yeah. He asked for her yeah, number. Yeah, she's tight. <laughs> I'm Put the fucking up. headphone against your ear. I'm wrap this up. You know what I want to know is like, what is his damn plan? He's telling her that they could kick it at the party, but then you guys are coming together to the party, supposedly. I'm put you on game real quick. He's gonna probably try to smash right now. Go home. Probably come up with a reason why not to come back for both of them and try to just keep both of them on the side, you know what I mean? And another thing too, I mean, he's probably still doing this when you're not watching, you know what I'm saying? You just have cameras set up right now. So I mean, he's Damn, nigga, shut it. up! No inhale, you want to keep this going? Why is just he saying all that? You keep it going? No. no. So you want to go down there and confront yes. him and everything? Yes. You gonna fuck her brain up. I've been ready to go. Been. Been. This test was wild. And honestly, guys, I was really rooting for DeAndre to pass. <laughs> I was hoping he could prove to Naya that he had a change and that he was going to be different. But I guess sayings are sayings for a reason, right? Once a cheater, always a cheater. Pretty adventurous, I guess. Oh, yeah? The craziest thing you've done on the beach? The craziest thing I've done? I don't know, like. Oh, yeah, see, he's trying to put his arm around her, but not really do it. I hope you guys got your talkies for this one. Because uh -oh. you guys. Oh, W legs. legs. This shit's gonna be good. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> it's a push, I got you. Ah, uh, little little aura points lost on that. I'll be honest. What the f are you doing? What the f is this? What are you doing? Caught. What are you doing? Can I get a caught in the chat? <laughs> what does what it look this? like? We're exposing you. Exposing We're exposing you. What? For being a cheater and a liar. How am I a cheater? You're, che you're sitting here on the beach, drinking, taking pictures. You said you would never cheat on me again. I didn't cheat on you. You said you would never cheat on me again. I know this You said you would never cheat on me again. You begged. You begged to have me back. What the f is this, bro? You got some camera crew? Yeah. <laughs> what? The world is about to see. How Yo, this nigga makes such good observations, man. <laughs> hey, way to identify the camera crew, buddy. Much you're oh. Liar. Yeah. Yeah. How do you feel? Like you stalking me. How do you me? feel? What type of bull is How do you feel? You stalking me now? What did you do? Follow me here? Listen, you were supposed to get the keys. Bro, I got the keys for you, did I not? Well, why are you sitting here at the beach having a picnic? Bro, you got drinks and taking pictures and shit. Coming and stalking me here on the beach? Because you're a cheater. How did I cheat on you? You begged to have me back. You begged. When did I cheat on you? You begged. Now you're sitting here taking pictures, drinking. Bro. With a whole nother girl talking yeah, about you're gonna see her. Girl. You're gonna okay. That's what I don't understand. You mean to tell me this nigga cheated, got caught, begged to have her back, and is still cheating? Nigga, just let her go. What's wrong with just breaking up with her? Why even go through all that? Do niggas, I, yo, I have a theory that some niggas are so bored and got no goals in their life, and they dead ass need conflict like this so that their life can be interesting. 
Dead ass because I don't know why anybody who has a goal in life and a purpose of any sort would want these type of problems. If you're if you thinking about cheating, bro, pack her up. That way we don't have to deal with this. But to beg for her back and then to cheat again, it makes no fucking sense. Her later and all this bro, it makes no sense. Want? So DeAndre, so just to let you know, this entire thing was a loyalty test. Your girlfriend wanted to find out if you were loyal to her. Yeah. Obviously you cheated on her in the past and stuff, and yeah. so she wanted to so see if you would cheat again. Business. <laughs> no, no, no. The reality is, like, none of this was real. This entire thing was was just made up and stuff. Nathan doesn't really live here. Yeah, you're a joke. There is no Becky. Becky doesn't exist. Violet's not really her friend. Like, everyone was just in on it to see, like, if you're mean or not. You don't trust me. That's I don't trust you. How can I? How can you? Maybe you should watch your thought ass friends and stop around. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Have you ever thought about this? Maybe you like getting cheated on. Oh, I like getting cheated on. Oh, Whoa, what in the Uno reverse? Who the fuck likes getting cheated on? No, you like being a cheater Bro, and a liar and a liar. Like, it looked like it. Looked like what? Maybe you should get in the water, you whale. Oh, you. All right, she gets one smack. She's allowed one smack, okay? And it's still not domestic violence, okay? She gets one free B slap. All right, a little get out of jail free card. She's allowed one slap at this point. It looked like it. Looked like what? Maybe you should get in the water, you whale. Oh, you got me. Uh, you got me. What the? You got me. Uh, say that again. Say it again. Get in the water. Say it again. Oh, you got me. I should grab you by your nappy ass hair. I should grab you by your nappy ass hair. She's in good shape, too. What the fuck is he talking about? Yeah. You're a joke. You're a joke. You're a joke. I'm out. You got me. Up. Stupid ass. Damn, I really thought she was gonna grab him by the hair. Not that I wanted it to, I'm just saying I thought it was gonna happen. Kudos to her Nigga, for not what? grabbing him by the hair. Wow. It's up the stairs. Wow. It's up the stairs. You make a left. Party's over. Are these. Are these his shoes? Which ones I'm are his so shoes? Done with are these his I'm shoes? I'm so done. I'm so done. I'm so done. DeAndre, you left your shoes, man. You want them or not? <laughs> you want? You want? You can have your shoes, bro. He's gonna walk home with his bare feet. <laughs> you don't want your shoes? How the f can he be mad? Like he said, the crowd. You did this to your self. What did you do to this man? How the f is he mad? DeAndre was going home barefoot. He was leaving and ditching his Crocs. <laughs> I don't know what was going through his head. You know a nigga mad when he's doing it two steps at a time. Back for them. But I think that's because he realized he also forgot his phone. Violet ended up finding it in the sand. Your Crocs are right here, bro. Nobody's trying to take your Crocs. Is that his phone? Give me his phone. GG's. Give me his phone. In the water. In the water. GG's. 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 Uh, nobody's trying to take anything. No. No you way like she's slamming. Give me your phone. Do what? Look at some more, you yeah. stalking ass. Oh! Go get your phone. Go get it. Stupid ass. Go get your phone. Go get your phone. That's cool. Look for it. Leave it behind me, bro. Stupid ass, bitch. <laughs> Come on. You forgot anything else? You actually, yeah, go leave. Please. Like you always do, go leave. Go leave. I don't give a f you. 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 I should grab him by his nappy ass hair. Why? Why do keep? Is that some shit people do? Why do they keep talking about that? You. You. At least got them dusty ass rocks for you. Thank God that this man only came back for his Crocs, his phone, and unfortunately to throw a couple more insults. Because honestly, I feel like this thing had the potential to just escalate into something else. Also, too, you can tell Naya was there to just stand on business. She walked into the sand, heels and all. This woman, <laughs> I just picture like as she's walking down, her heels turn into like sandals <laughs> because the heel part sinks. <laughs> Choke. Embarrassing me. Embarrassing me. Literally. I mean, I don't... So you're done? You're leaving? You're leaving? Damn. That was just us. Did you take off? Know?
It seemed like Naya wanted to have one last conversation with DeAndre, but he wanted to get out of here. It was a good thing, too, because she probably would have grabbed him by his hair this time, you know? <laughs> like his nappy ass here. <laughs> Sorry about everything. You did what you had to do. Yeah. But at least you know now, like, oh, it's, he does not deserve your time. He's like, not a second of it. Phone, oh, I'm so Honestly, he's lucky he didn't chuck his phone in the water. I'm he's real. Lucky. He's lucky Literally. he didn't chuck his phone in the Stupid water. Stupid ass bitch. Holy you were gaslighting and name no, calling. I'm, That's no. crazy. No. You deserve better. You do. There's no coming back from this. No. I'm blocking him. There's no coming yeah, back. Okay. Like, it's done. Okay. Stupid ass bitch. Yeah, I don't believe her. Hey man, that was a, uh, it was a, the beginning of the video kind of started slow, but it picked up for sure. Is this tomorrow's teachings? <laughs> no, nigga, it's not. Oh, so you like the video? Yeah. Boom. Oh, yeah. You, you're gonna like that one too, man. Go ahead, just. Bro, click the link. What the? Bro, that's what I be saying, like.